Yo, what's up guys, so welcome back to a brand new video here on my channel and in today's video I'm gonna show you a special trick each and every single one of you can do right now on your Windows PC to actually boost your FPS in Fortnite. And guys, trust me, there are so many people which don't know about this and I'm gonna show you step by step exactly what I mean. It's gonna be a super easy and quick tutorial and if you enjoy content like this, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel, this would help me out so, so much. And without any further ado, let's get straight into this topic. And what I want to show you here pretty much in today's tutorial is how to make sure that your PC is actually running at 100%. And there's some stuff you guys can do in your BIOS and I'm just going to explain everything step by step so don't be worried. And yeah, pretty much what you need to do in the first place is actually go into your BIOS guys. And yeah, if you're like right now like freaking out, oh okay yo, I never changed anything in there, it seems all super complicated. But don't be worried guys, I'm just going to give you like a secret tip um, pretty much before you start this whole entire thing here, maybe make sure to know at least like from which brand your motherboard is because this can actually like highly help you out or let's just say you have your phone with you that's also fine but as mentioned what I would recommend you is that you at least know from which brand your motherboard is because this can help you out a lot and what we now need to do is actually restart our PC and get into our BIOS and that's exactly why I told you guys that you need to know from which brand your motherboard is because in each and every brand it's always like different what you have to press for me it was like I think F11 for some people it's F9 or Backspace or I don't know F2 F3 literally all kinds of different buttons you know on this afro so therefore just google from which factory your motherboard is so therefore you just like insta know what to press because this screen only appears for a few seconds so therefore you don't have like too much time to read everything down there and this just makes it so much easier so guys and once you're in your bios what you want to do is find a setting which is called advanced memory settings it should be normally on the first page guys but as mentioned it's really like coming down to the fact from which brand your motherboard is because all the biases are looking a little bit different but what you want to look for is as mentioned advanced memory settings it should be called as well for you like this so therefore just simply look for this tab and now as you clicked on this category guys you should see extreme memory profile which is called XMP and this is just gonna make sure that your RAM is literally running at the highest available frequency so therefore you can have maximum FPS on Fortnite or in games in general and if you can see right now that it is selected to auto guys please make sure to put it actually on profile one this is super important then next one we can see XMP high frequency support and please also make sure that that's set to auto and system memory multiplier as well to auto and as you can see now guys my memory frequency is actually set to 3000 which is the maximum my memory can do right now here I'm running 32 gigs of HyperX Predator 3000 megahertz RAM but what I usually do guys is I overclock it to 3200 megahertz but since you need like really high tier RAM to overclock it successfully and also for it to be stable I would simply recommend you to keep it on the highest XMP can literally offer you here on your PC and as you can see normally this would be for me 3000 megahertz so I'm just gonna leave it on that and trust me guys I know so many people who have like at least like 3000 megahertz megahertz RAM but they're still running like only like 2400 megahertz or like 2667 megahertz you know you're just missing out on potential performance which you could be utilizing for gaming guys so therefore once you're done with this step here you're just simply gonna go onto save and restart which should be like on the top right of your BIOS at least for most of the brands I always put it like on the top right and there you can just simply save it and restart your PC and everything should be applied already and your PC is successfully running at 100% of its potential and once you're done with that guys please also don't forget to check out all my other optimization guides I have so many here literally for low end PCs laptops high tier PCs literally anything guys fully optimized game user settings everything which could somehow boost your FPS and with that said we're already done here guys and if you enjoyed today's video please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel this would help me out so so much and if you still have any more questions feel free to ask me them down in the comment section below I try to answer as many as possible and with that said have a great day have a great night whenever you're watching this and until next time stay awesome I'm out peace